Dora and Diego by the shore. It was a beautiful sunny day. Dora, her best friend Boots, and her cousin Diego decided to head out to the beach. They were just about to change into their swimsuits when Boots told them he had a surprise. It was Dora's scrapbook filled with pictures from other times they had visited the shore. Boots loved Dora's scrapbook. He couldn't wait to see the pictures again. Boots knew the photos would bring back so many great memories. Dora smiled when she saw a photo of Boots swimming. Look, Boots, Dora said. Here are some photos from when Mariana, the mermaid, taught you how to swim. I remember that, Boots said. Mariana showed me how to move my arms in the water and how to kick my legs. You were a fast learner, Boots, Dora said. It wasn't long before you were swimming all by yourself. Diego grinned as Dora turned the page. I remember this adventure. We went to the beach one night to watch baby sea turtles hatch. I helped the turtles get to the water by leading them with my flashlight. Look at that big full moon, Boots said. Many baby turtles are born when the moon is full, Boots, Diego explained. They swim into the ocean under the moon's light. And someday, when those turtles are all grown up, the mommy turtles will return to that very same beach to lay turtle eggs. That was a terrific turtle adventure, Dora said. Boots was so excited when he saw the next photo. He started to jump up and down. I remember this adventure, Dora, he cheered. This picture is from the time we saved a baby crab. The poor baby crab was caught in a net, Dora remembered. First, we had to cut through the net and free him. And then we had to sing and dance for the squishy squid so he would let us pass, Boots said. Do you remember that, Dora? And then we finally made it to Crab Island, where baby crab gave his mommy a shell necklace, Dora said. They both looked so happy. Wow, cool submarine, Diego, Boots said. I really like this photo. I remember this great underwater rescue, Diego said. I used my rescue sub to help some ocean animals trapped in coral, and I couldn't do it alone. I needed a giant octopus to help me, Diego said. The giant octopus used his eight arms to dig a hole under the coral. All the ocean animals were able to swim to safety. Eight arms sure can come in handy, Boots said. Diego turned the page of the scrapbook and said, Dora, check out this picture. You're a mermaid. Fantastico. Boots jumped up and down again. That's from when you helped save Mermaid Kingdom, right, Dora? That's right, Boots, Dora answered. Mariana, the mermaid, lent me her crown. The crown let me have one wish. I wish to clean up Mermaid Kingdom. Now it's a beautiful and clean place for our friend Mariana to live. When Boots turned to the next page of the scrapbook, it was empty. Why aren't there any pictures here, Dora? Boots asked. Because that's where I'm going to put our pictures after today's visit to the shore, Dora said. I wonder what adventure we are going to have today. Whatever it is, I know it will be great, Boots said. It always is when we're together, Diego said. A la playa, amigos. We are off to the beach. Dora closed the scrapbook, and the three friends ran off to the beach for their next adventure.